Hi, I'm Allie, and we're at St. Pete Better at Beach Camp, week five. This is Nicole, and today we're working on a private lesson of defense and hitting. This next one, hitting a down ball or a high line, all right? So with the high lines, I'm gonna try to like move you deep and short so that we find that control. We wanna be able to control the ball and have a consistent dig location. If we can have a semi-consistent dig location, that makes our, our life and our partner's lives a lot easier because then everything's in flow and motion and not chaotic. All right, here we go. Great job, Nicole. Stay balanced, stay patient. Ah, oh, wait till the set, wait till the set. <laughs> here we go, ball. Come on, there we go, love that. I love how low you stayed. That's awesome. Keep that, that uh, angle of your platform in mind. Here we go, short one, short one. Yes, nice. So on that one, you popped up as you were running. Try to keep those hips low. Remember, eyes down here. Good, way to stay patient. Your butt came back a little bit, but we got it, all good. Go, nice. Did you see how your weight transferred on that? That was awesome. Here we go. Because you're in a good position of being able to go side to side. That was awesome. Ball. Come on. There we go. I like it. Ball. Ooh, a little quick, but good reaction. <laughs> good reaction. Go. Good. So you're leaning a little bit, but you're giving yourself time to come back. So I'm okay with it. Just try to be wherever you feel balanced. Oh, short, come on, come on, come on. Good try. Don't be afraid to dive, lay out for that ball. Cause if you feel yourself like bending over like this for the ball, then we know we're, we're out of position. But if we're here underneath the ball, then we know we're in a better position. So you just gotta trust your leg strength. You got it. Use it. Ball. Come on. Yeah, love that, love that. Come on, nice, nice one. Way to stay calm on that ball. Come on, come on, Nicole. Yes, Nicole, thank you for getting dirty. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> so remember how we, great round, great round. Remember how we said, when I'm contacting, we wanna be in a position to react? A couple of them, you were moving as I was hitting, probably because you recognized my tendencies and I was making them pretty early. But try to, like I use my breath when I'm playing defense. So if I'm in a position and it's a crazy rally or something, I'm trying to be here and then react, <clears throat> if that makes sense. So we'll play around with it. But now, let's do cut shots. So with the cut shot, the footwork is the same. It's a first, like first it's a big cross step to a layout kind of. So if my hitter's over here, I wanna go here, here, right? If I need to, I can lay out for that ball. If I don't need to, I don't need to. But with a cut shot, we wanna contact the ball as low to the ground as we can, and then we wanna pop it straight up if we can. So try not to swing your arms a lot because the ball will already have a lot of energy on it. So we don't have to add anything to it. So we're gonna go back to kind of like square one where I'm on the same side as you. And we're just gonna get that feeling. This one might get you a little dirty. I apologize in advance. <laughs> All right, so you're fronting your hitter. Show me the footwork, go. That's a lot of steps. You only need two, right? Two and a half if we can. So we may have to just drop to a knee. But we also want to end with our right leg in front because that way we're supporting the ball back into the court. If you have your left leg in front and you're on the right side, you're cutting yourself off from the court and your partner, right? But if we're here and we come, okay, cross here, everything's coming back into the court. Does that make sense? You see kind of the difference in that? So we always wanna just keep working back into the court. Ball, go. 
Nice, good. I'm gonna try to challenge, like toss it a little lower too. Keep those hips low though, no matter what, and try to get the ball as low to the ground as you can. Try to challenge yourself to really like, wait, 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 play a game of chicken with the ball. Wait, 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 and then pop it straight up. Ah! <laughs> Where's the shot going? <laughs> Go, come on, come on. Yes, cancel, freeze. Yeah, good fix, good fix, good fix. Here we go. Go, come on. Nice, you're getting there. I think you're just taking a lot of steps. Try to take less steps. So only the one crossover step, and then your right leg will come around, and then you're there. One step, go. Yes, you're still bringing that, that leg through, so go onto a knee. So this is what I want you to do. We're gonna come from the cut shot here, here, here. So your left leg is gonna end, you're gonna end on your knee like this, okay? Turn your body a little more towards it. Yeah, perfect. Go. Yes, 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 yes. That's what we're working for. Good, here we go. And then instead of up here, just a little lower. But piece by piece, we got this. Ah, oh, my speed, you're, you're fast. I promise, you're fast, you can do this. Go, lift, thank you. That's nice, that's nice, here we go. And we're just trying to pop that ball straight up. Come on, good, nice reach, nice reach, here we go. Nice, good, go into that. So on that one, we were, you were on the ground early, which was good, and then your arms, we're kind of up here above your head. So if you can, try to get them down here. Keep that ball in front of you and keep it low because then we have the most control on the ball. I know that so feel, sounds a little strange, but we do. Okay. Because what if it's super windy? Right. Or what if it's raining? The lower we can contact the ball, the more elements we get rid of. Go. Come on, come on. Yes, nice up, nice up. Go. Come on. Yes, Nicole, I love that. You were super calm on that touch. That was perfect. Awesome, one step over. Good. What if I hit you with a high line? Ah, oh, she did it. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> Here we go, good, good. Ball, come on. Yes, good, little lower. So you're still up here a little bit, just a little bit lower. Go, good. You, lean, you leaned into it, right? You were there a little bit early, but it was a good dig location. Yeah. So even if one thing is like not textbook or correct, but other pieces are right, we can make up for that, that other stuff, you know? Great job. Here we go, one more. Oh, my girl. <laughs> Here we go. Ball. Low, low. Yes, good flick. Nice, here we go. Lay on your belly and then do a sand, a sand angel like that. No, like on the sand. Yeah, give me, yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Yeah, your feet don't need it, but just your arms. <laughs> One, perfect, okay, so now stand, get on your knees. We're gonna do this drill this morning, but we're gonna do it right now too. I'm gonna toss the ball here. Basically, what we're gonna do is you're gonna, this is an emergency touch. So you're gonna lay out and try to pop it up. Support yourself with your other hand. So I'm gonna go to this side first. Yep, yep, one hand. Yes! See how low you were to the ground? Yeah. That's how I want you to dig a cut shot. This way. Yes! Bang, that was awesome. One more, one more to each side. Good touch, good touch, that's it. I'm trying to extend you, no worries. Go. Yes, Nicole, perfect. That's how low I want you to be when you dig a cut shot. The lower you can be, the better. Whereas indoor, that's not necessarily the case. Indoor, we wanna cut that ball off fast because it's coming fast, right? This ball is coming fast too, but if we can catch it at a low point and then we can control the energy on it, that's what we wanna try to get to, if that makes sense. But I feel you, like there's a, biz there's a difference in indoor and in beach defense. Ball. Good, okay, so same thing, yeah. And same thing we did on that side, let's try to end in a lunge. So if we were here and Tanya was my hitter, I'm 
cross, cross, and do a knee here. Now, this turns into a layout here. Low, 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 yes, 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 Nicole, awesome. Now, if you need to, you may be able to get a little bit more distance with one arm on that. We just saw that you have really good ball control with one hand. If you need to, and you get that left arm around, you can pop that ball straight up, and that's still a good dig. Go. Yes, good. A Little bit high, but we're getting there. We're getting there. Ball, short. Yes. Nice up, nice up, yup. At least you're feeling it now though, right? The lower, the better. Ball. Yes, I like it, I like it. We're getting there, all right. Hopefully you guys learned something today. Leave your questions in the comments, like and subscribe, and we'll see you soon.